So, finally going to play this game. My kids have been asking for a very long time. I've actually had this game in my list for a very long time, but I had bought it for them to begin with, and then they got their own Steam accounts. So long ago, two races ruled over Earth, humans and monsters. One day, war broke out between the two races. After a long battle, the humans were victorious. They sealed the monsters underground with a magic spell. Many years later, Mount Ebbet, 2001X. Legends say that those who climb the mountain never return. Big hole. Tripped over a root. And down we go. Down we go. Ugh. Doesn't look like a very soft landing place. Surprise the kid's okay. Undertale. <laughs> enter. Okay. Instructions. Z or enter to confirm. X or shift to cancel. That's going to be annoying. C or control is the menu. F4 is full screen. F4. Uh, escape is to quit. When HP is zero, you lose. Uh, enter. Name the fallen human. I had a huge talk with my kids about this earlier. We're going to go with Phoenix. Phoenix. Done. Phoenix. Oh, uh, good enough. I missed the eye somehow. Or it's too long. One of the two. Phoenix. Here I go. Howdy! I'm Flowey. Flowey the flower. Hmm. You're new to the underground, aren't ya? Golly, you must be so confused. Someone ought to teach you how things work around here. I guess little old me will have to do. Ready? Here we go. See that heart? That is your soul. The very culmination of your being. Your soul starts off weak, but it can go strong if you gain a lot of LV. What's LV stand for? Why, love, of course. You want some love, don't you? Maybe. Don't worry, I'll share some with you. Down here, love is shared through little white friendliness pellets. Are you ready? Move around. Get as many as you can. You idiot. In this world, it's kill or be killed. Why would anyone pass up an opportunity like this? Rude. Die! I'd rather not. Ha. Oh. <gasps> Aw. Hi, goat lady. What a terrible creature. Torturing such a Poor innocent youth. Ah, oh, do not be afraid, my child. I am Toriel. Hi, Toriel. 
caretaker of the ruins. I pass through this place every day to see if anyone has fallen down. You are the first human to come here in a long time. Come, I will guide you through the catacombs. Goat mom, it's the nice goat lady. Goat mom, my kid says it's goat mom. All right, goat mom, let's go. This way. Follow the goat mom. Hi, goat mom. <gasps> ooh, ooh, ooh. The shadow of the ruins looms above, filling you with determination. HP fully restored. Save. Okay. Follow goat mom some more. Welcome to your new home, innocent one. Good thing I went with a more innocent sounding name, huh? Imagine calling the Zuzu innocent one. Allow me to educate you in the operation of the ruins. The ruins are full of puzzles, ancient fusions between diversions and door keys. One must solve them to move from room to room. Please adjust yourself to the sight of them. I mean, I've played a puzzle horror game or two. I, I, I know something about puzzles. Chatsy, only the fearless may proceed. Brave ones, foolish ones, both walk not the middle road. Which one do you think your brother is? I shouldn't have asked that. To make progress here, you will need to trigger several switches. Do not worry, I have labeled the ones that you need to flip. Press Z to read signs. But I just pressed enter and I read it. Stay on the path. Why do I push the wrong one? No, no, no! You want to press the other switch. I even labeled it for you. <laughs> what if I keep trying to press this one? No, it just keeps seeing the same thing. Fine, goat mom, I'll behave. Splendid. I am proud of you, little one. Let us move to the next room. As a human living in the underground, monsters may attack you. You will need to be prepared for this situation. However, worry not. The process is simple. You encounter a monster, you will enter a fight. While you are in a fight, strike up a friendly conversation. But I always do in fights. Stall for time. It will come to resolve the conflict. I will come to resolve the conflict. Practice talking to the dummy. So, um... Uh... Hello, how's your day? Uh, act. Dummy. Talk. Uh, how, how are you doing today? It, it's not answering. I won! Ah, very good. You are very good. Thank you. I try. There's another puzzle in this room. I wonder if you can solve it. Frog it! There's no... Okay, I guess I'm complimenting the frog it. <laughs> oh, oh! Oh! I won! The look on Toriel's face, she's like... That's a very mom look. Side eye. The western room is the eastern room's blueprint. Um... Uh-huh. 
Aha. This is the puzzle, but here, take my hand for a moment. But you're not even letting me try to solve it. Thank you, Goat Mom. Puzzles seem a little too dangerous for now. You've done excellently thus far, my child. However, I have a difficult request to ask of you. I would like you to walk to the end of the room by yourself. Forgive me for this. Well, alrighty then. Unnecessarily dramatic music and an unnecessarily long room. Hi! Greetings, my child. Do not worry, I did not leave you. I was merely behind this pillar the whole time, you don't say, Goat Mom. Thank you for trusting me. However, there was an important reason for this exercise. To test your independence. You know, letting me solve the puzzle in the last room might have also tested my independence. I must attend to some business, and you must stay alone for a while. Please, remain here. It's dangerous to explore by yourself. I have an idea. I will give you a cell phone if you have a need for anything. Just call. Be good, all right? Must I? How does she fit back there? If little old me won't fit back there. Ring. Hello, this is Torio. You have not left the room, have you? There are a few puzzles ahead that I have yet to explain. It would be dangerous to try to solve them yourself. Be good, all right? Ribbit. Ribbit. Excuse me, human. I have some advice for you about battling monsters. That's what Ribbit Ribbit meant, okay? You act a certain way or fight until you almost defeat them. They might not want to battle you anymore. If a monster does not want to fight you, please... Use some mercy, human ribbit. Playfully crinkling through the leaves fills you with determination. Okay. Saved. What's up here? It says, take one. Take a piece of candy? Yes. Take a piece of candy. I be good. I take one. Crinkle through some more leaves. Oh. Compliment the froggit. Blushes deeply. Ribbit. Froggit seems reluctant to fight you. Uh, wait. Bear. I earned a zero experience, but two gold, finally. Okay, let's see here. Oh. I fall down. Oh. Win Wim Sun approached meekly. Console. Halfway through your first word. Wim Sun bursts into tears and runs away. Oh, Poor little thing. Okay. Ring. Hello, this is Doriel. For no reason in particular, which do you prefer? Cinnamon or butterscotch? Butterscotch. Oh, I see. Thank you very much. Click. Hello, this is Doriel. Uh, you do not dislike cinnamon do you i know what your preference is but uh w would you turn up your nose if you found it on your plate yes actually i 
kind of would, unless you masked it really well. Oh, right, right, I understand. Thank you for being patient, by the way. Click. Three out of four gray rocks recommend you push them. Really? That was incredibly weirdly timed. It's okay. It's okay. Did I say something wrong? The music in this game is very loud. Oh boy. Well, it's not that one. Oh, all the way over, all the way down, over two, all the way up, over three, four. Ouch. Oh. Okay, they both left. Nice. Then all the way down and over again. Okay, let's see if I can remember that. All the way over. All... Mold small. Imitate. You lie immobile with mold small. You feel like you understand the world a little better. Scorch. Mold small waits pensively. Okay, that works. All the way down. Over, up. I did it! Okay, so if three out of four rocks recommend I push them. Then which one of those do I need to push? Alright, I'm gonna lie down with them again. Burbel, burb. Whoa there, partner. Who said you could push me around? Hmm? So you're asking me to move over? Okay, just for you, pumpkin. Hmm? Oh, you want me to move some more? Alrighty, how's this? That was the wrong direction? Okay, think I got it. Thank you. You wanted me to stay there? You're giving me a real workout. He pushes me over. Ah, my goodness. Pair of froggets. All right, froggets. Froggy didn't understand, but was flattered anyways. The froggit says meow? I'm not sure that's how froggits work. Ouch. You are intimidated by froggits raw strength. Only kidding. Meow. Again. I don't think that's how froggits are supposed to work. Yeah, I don't think so. Compliment. Ouch. Can I... I ate the monster candy. Okay, there we go. I'm not very good at dodging, apparently. 
Knowing the mouse might one day leave its hole and get the cheese, it fills you with determination. Okay. This cheese has been here quite a long time. It's stuck to the table. Go get the cheese. Is there even a mouse in the hole? Oh! Cute! Okay. Ah! My favorite character. He's sleeping. Are they gone yet? Oh, he's pretending to sleep. This coast keeps saying Z out loud repeatedly, pretending to sleep. Let's move it with force? No. Do I have to? I have to move it with force. No, I guess. Here comes Napstablook. Cheer him up. You gave Napstablook a patient smile. <laughs> Napstablook looks just a little bit better. You told Napstablook a little joke. <laughs> Aww. Cheering seems to have improved Napsabook's mood again. I just weigh you down. Ah, cheering seems to have improved Napsabook's mood again. He wants to show me something. Let me try. Aww! I call it Dapper Blook. Aww, I love it! I love it. You're amazing, Napsabook. Looking about. Uh. Oh, gee. I usually come to the ruins because there's nobody around. But today, I met somebody nice. Oh, I'm rambling again. I'll get out of your way. Aw, Napsabla, come back! He's my favorite. What's the other way? It's this way. Spider bake sale. All proceeds go to real spiders. 10G? Leave 7G in the web? Yes. Spiders crawl down and give you a donut. I got a donut. Oh, I didn't have 18 anyways, so we'll go with the 7. Okay. I've been told not to eat it. Until, until a specific fight. Okay. Did you miss it? Spider bake sale down into the right. Uh, nope, I, I did it. Come eat food made by spiders. For spiders. Of spiders. Of spiders? Ribbit, ribbit. Sigh. My friend never listens to me. Whenever I talk, they skip through my words by pressing X. That's right. Pressing X. Well, at least you listen to me. Ribbit, ribbit. I heard using F4 can make you have a full screen. Yep, I have that now. What does F4 stand for? Four frogs? I've only seen a maximum of three frogs in this room. This is troubling, to say the least. Ribbit. Ribbit, ribbit. I have heard you are quite merciful for a human. Hey. Rude. What are you doing? What are you doing? Okay. Um, surely you know by now a monster is a yellow name when you can spare it. What do you think of that? Very helpful. It's bad. Very helpful. It is rather helpful. You remember sparing is just saying you won't fight. Maybe one day, you'll have to do it, even if their name isn't yellow. Here? Ring? Hell, is that what was supposed to happen? <laughs> Hello? I just realized that it has been a while since I have cleaned up. I was not expecting to have company so soon. 
There are probably a lot of things lying about here and there. You can pick them up, but do not carry more than you need. Someday, you might see, see something you really like. You will want to leave room in your pockets for that. Is that what was supposed to happen? No. It's a looks! Don't pick on. Finally, someone gets it. But now you're picking on me, though. That was rude. Stop. Rude. Finally, someone gets it. I looks. Supposedly, there's supposed to be something over here, but I can't find it. was supposed to happen? Yeah. Smells like eye drops. Eye drops? Hiya, Bells! Alright, give me a little bit of time for the tattoo, Sweet Pete. There's an ant-sized frog in a crack in the wall. It waves at you. There you go. Was that what was supposed to happen? Oh, okay. You did do a thing, Bells. You did do a thing. There's just one switch. Ah, <sighs> Vegetoid? Talk? Plants can't talk, dummy. You're talking, dumbskull. Ouch. You pat your stomach. Vegetoid offers a healthy meal. Eat your greens. I missed it. Vegetoid gave a mysterious smile. You tried to eat Vegetoid, but it wasn't weakened enough. Part of a complete breakfast. Pat your stomach. Vegetoid offers a healthy meal. Ouch. Okay. Spare. Sheesh. One switch. Maybe in one of these? Hi, Sequan! How are you? Okay, so I need to get there. Got it. This one. And another act. Pat your stomach, offers a healthy meal. Eat your greens! Okay. Okay. Barum. I hope you have a great day as well, suck one. Uh, the far door is not an exit. It simply marks a rotation in perspective. If you can read this, press the blue switch. Oh no.
Okay. Eat your greens. I missed it. But it's... Ah! This one's tough. Farmed locally. Very locally. Dang, nab it. You cannot give up just yet. Phoenix, stay determined. It's been a while since I last saved. Alright, so I'm back to where I was now. If you can read this, press the red switch. My gosp crawled close. I don't care. Uh, ouch. Ouch. I lie immobile. I feel like I understand the world a little better. Me and me is the best. Oh, I can spare him now. Okay. There we go. So the red switch. So just this one? Yes. That one was easy. You can read this, press the green switch. Don't pick on. Okay, spare him. The green one, it said? Green. Ugh. I'm not gonna pick on them. Why would I pick on them? There we go. So, is the one that's closer to blue. Yes. Okay. Oh. A pair of looks decided to pick on you. Ouch. Quit staring at me. Don't pick on him. Ouch. Wait, no. There we go. Not very good at this. This does not bode well for later in the game. What's up here? Oh, dear. That took longer than I thought it would. Hi, goat mom. Oh, hi. How did you get here, my child? Are you hurt? There, there. I will heal you. I should not have left you alone for so long. Hey, I made it here, goat mom. It was irresponsible to try to surprise you like this. Uh, well, I suppose I cannot hide any longer. Come, small one. I give me a second. What was this way? Just between you and me, I saw Toriel come out of here a little while ago. She was carrying some groceries. I didn't ask what they were for. We're all too intimidated to talk to her. Really? She seems so nice. You found the toy knife.
Why does I have a toy knife? Seeing such a cute, tidy house in the ruins gives you determination. Oh, it's the save file is home. Do you smell that? Surprise! It is a butterscotch cinnamon pie. I thought we might celebrate your arrival. I want you to have a nice time living here, so I will hold off on snail pie for tonight. You know what? Honestly, I might have preferred that. Here, I have another surprise for you. Where are you going, Goat Mom? This is it. A room of your own. I hope you like it. Ah, Patting him on the head. Something burning? Um, make yourself at home. Tutorial's as good a cook as I am. Aw, this room is adorable. Look at these cool toys. They don't interest you at all. Aw. An empty photo frame. It's really dusty. box of kids' shoes and a disparity of sizes. Bedtime. Aww. She left me pie. We found a slice of butterscotch cinnamon pie. Alright, going to bed. It won't let me go back to bed. You've seen this type of plant before, but do not know its name. It's Toriel's Diary. Read the circled passage. No! It's an encyclopedia of subterranean plants. You open to the middle. Typha, a group of wetland flowering plants with brown oblong oblong seed pods known more commonly as water sausages same one okay water sausages interesting you peek inside scandalous it's Toriel's sock drawer <gasps> my goodness ah the cactus truly the most sundary of plants Just a regular old bucket of snails. Bucket! I found the bucket. But I can't take it. I will be forever alone and sad. Inside the drawer are flower seeds and some broken crayons. Room under renovations. Really? Ooh. It's you! Yes, it is me. Oh! It is a water sausage. Water sausage. Okay, now I see. Nap time. What's here? Oh, that's outside. What's over here? Goat mom! Up already, I see. Um, I want you to know how glad I am to have someone here. There are so many old books I want to share. I want to show you my favorite bug hunting spot. I've also prepared a curriculum for your education. Science? This may come as a surprise to you. But I've always wanted to be a teacher. Actually, perhaps that isn't very surprising, but still. I am glad to have you living here. Oh, did you want something? What is it? Nothing. Well, talk to me again if you need anything. The history book. Here's a random page. Trapped behind the barrier and fearful of further human attacks, we retreated. Oh. Far, far into the earth we walked. Till we reached the cavern's end. It was our new home, which we named Home. Nice. Welcome home. Huh? 
As great as our king is, he is pretty lousy at names. The ends of the tools have been filed down to make them safer. Aww. The fire isn't burning hot, just pleasantly warm. You can put your hand inside. Can I put my hand on the fire? Put your hand on the fire. All right, let's over here. God, kitchen. For some reason, there is a brand name chocolate bar in the fridge. There is some white fur stuck in the drain. Inside the cupboard are cookie cutters for gingerbread monsters. Aww. The size of the pie intimidates you too much for you to eat it. Really? The stovetop is very clean. Toriel must use fire magic instead. Or she just cleans her stove? What's downstairs? I think you should play upstairs instead. Hmm. But what's downstairs? It is dangerous to play here. I made it all the way here. I want to play in the sewers. It is true after here. You will catch cold. I have to talk to her, don't I? I want to play in the underground. It is dusty here. You will catch a cough. How many different ways can she say that? I want to play in the underground, Mom. Mom. Oh, hello. Did you want to hear about the book I am reading? It is called 72 Uses for Snails. How about it? Sure. Here's an exciting snail fact. Did you know that snails sometimes flip their digestive systems as they mature? Interesting. Can't I just stay in the ruins forever and have Toriel be my mom? What's up, Bella? I have to do something. Stay here. Aww. Poor goat mom. Anyways, I'm gonna go play in the underground. You wish to know how to return home, do you not? Ahead of us lies the end of the ruins. A one-way exit to the rest of the underground. I am going to destroy it. No one will ever be able to leave again. I'll be a good child and go upstairs. No, Mom! Home. Mom! Like home, Mom! Mom! Every human that falls down here meets the same fate. I have seen it again and again. They come. They leave. They die. You naive child. Leave the ruins. They, Asgore, will kill you. I'm sorry to hear that, Bells. I am only protecting you. Do you understand? Go to your room. Mom! Do not try to stop me. This is your final warning. Goat, Mom! You want to leave so badly? Hmm. You are just like the others. Oh, there's only one solution to this. Prove yourself. Proved me you are strong enough to survive. Uh oh. Goat mom? Couldn't think of any conversation topics. <laughs> Ow. He tried to think of something to say again, but. Dang, damn it. Ironically, talking does not seem to be the solution to this situation.
Doriel takes a deep breath. I can't get it to hit me now if I try. Doriel's yeah. acting aloof. Doriel <coughs> looks through you. Spare. What are you doing? Doriel prepares a magical attack. Nope. Attack or run away. Come on, Goat Mom, hit me. What are you proving this way? That I'm strong enough to get through. Fight me or leave. No. that way. Yep, prepare all the magical attacks, Toriel. Come on! you want to go home, but please go upstairs now. I promise I will take good care of you here. If it was me, I'd stay. I know we do not have much, but we can have a good life here. Why are you making this so difficult? Please go upstairs. Oh. <laughs> Pathetic, is it not? I cannot save even a single child. I want to stay. <laughs> No, I understand. We'd just be unhappy trapped down here. The ruins are very small once you get used to them. It would not be right for you to grow up in a place like this. My expectations, my loneliness, my fear. For you, my child, I will put them aside. I want goat mom. I want to bring her with me. I truly wish to leave the ruins. I will not stop you. However... When you leave, please do not come back. I hope you understand. Aw, goat mom hug! Goat mom hugs! That's it. Goat mom hug for Bella. Oh, my, my bot's not up. Why is my bot not up? There we go. Goat mom hug for Bella. Goodbye, my child. Psycho mom. 